afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. This is Miss Breanne, and welcome to another video of our Artful Calligraphy series. The series where I teach you the art style of beautiful lettering. Now, as I said in my previous video, we had finished the first group of lowercase letters and words. In our, in our previous video, we did a review of our lowercase letters that we've learned so far. In today's video, we're going to do a review of the words that we've learned so far. So, are you ready to begin? Alright, let's get started. The first word we're going to review is the word man, which is what you did for, which was the word that you used in your very first art project. So, as a review, I'm going to start at the baseline. Overturn, overturn, compound curve, back up to the waistline, then you're going to make your O shape, underturn, which leads to an overturn, then a compound curve. Now as I said before, it's just, the words are just the letters that you have to put together and write in quick succession to each other. So, let's finish the rest of this line. Good job, boys and girls. The next word we're going to learn is the word in, which is I-N. So start at the baseline, entrance stroke to the waistline, underturn, leading to an overturn, and a compound curve, dot the I. That's it. So I'm going to give you a minute to finish this on your own. And as I've mentioned before, you can dot your I's right away, or you can wait till you finish the line and then dot your I's all at once. the next review the next word which is the word it are you ready to begin all right just the word letters I T so start at the baseline entrance stroke to the waistline under turn back up to the waistline then just underneath the top line pedal push slant but curve at the end dot the I cross the T so I'll give you a minute to finish this on your own, and you can dot your I's and cross your T's right away, or wait until you finish the line and dot your I's and cross your T's all at once. Good job, boys and girls. Let's learn our next word. And that is the word at. And again, that's only two letters, A and T. So start at the baseline, entrance stroke to the waistline, make the O shape starting from just underneath the waistline, under turn. Up back up to the waistline, then just underneath the top line, pedal push slant, but curve at the end. Cross your teeth. 
Okay, so I'll give you a minute to finish that on your own. And like I said before, you can cross your T's right away. Or you can wait till you finish the line and then cross your T's all at once. And remember, practice, practice, practice. All right, good job. The next word we're going to do is the word win. And that's three letters, W-I-N. So you can start your baseline, entrance stroke to the waistline, underturn, under turn, but just before you go to the waistline, you're going to loop. Then you're going to do an under turn, which leads to an over turn, and a compound curve, dot your eye. All right, I'll give you a minute to finish that on your own. And you can dot your eyes right away, or wait until you finish the line, and then dot your eyes at once. Good job! The next word we're going to review is the word TAN. And those are the letters T-A-N. So start your baseline, entrance stroke to the waistline. Just underneath the top line, you're going to start your pedal push slant, but curve and come up at the bottom, back to the waistline. Make your O shape just underneath the waistline. Under turn, which leads to an over turn. Then a compound curve, cross the T. All right, I'll give you a minute to finish this on your own. And you can cross your T's right away, or wait until you finish the line, and then cross your T's at once. Good job, boys and girls. The next letter word we're going to learn is the word tin. And those are the letters T-I-N. So start at the baseline, entrance stroke to the waistline. Just underneath the top line, you're going to do a pedal push slant, but curve and go up at the end to the waistline. Under turn, which leads to an over turn, which leads to a compound curve. Cross your T, dot your I. All right, I'll give you a minute to finish this on your own. And you can cross your T's and dot your I's right away. Or wait until you finish the line and cross your T's and dot your I's at once. Good job, boys and girls. Two more words to go. The next word we're going to learn is the word, or review, is the word pan. And those are the lowercase letters P-A-N. So start the baseline, entrance stroke to the waistline, 
at the waistline, pedal push slant, compound curve, back to the waistline, underturn, which leads to an overturn, and compound curve. You know what, we're going to do pin instead because I kind of glitched and put an I instead of an A. So we'll do pan as our last word instead of the next one. But dot the I. All right, I'll give you a minute to finish this on your own. And as I've mentioned before, you can dot your I's right away. Or wait until you finish the line and then dot your I's at once. Okay, let's review our last word. And the last word is the word pan. And that's P-A-N. And I promise I will actually write the word pan this time. All right. So we start at the baseline. Entrance stroke to the waistline. From the waistline, you're going to do your pedal push slant. Then do a compound curve back to the waistline. Just underneath the waistline, you're going to make your O shape followed by an underturn, which leads to an overturn, then a compound curve. All right, I'll give you a minute to finish that on your own. Good job, boys and girls. You have just reviewed all of the words in our with our first group of lowercase letters. And you've also reviewed all the first group of lowercase letters. In our next video, we are going to do our second art project, which is you're going to choose any of the words that we've learned in, our, in the first group of videos. And I'm going to teach you how to blend contrast and colors and add white designs to your letters. And I also have a special surprise for you at the end of the video, so please follow along until the end. Take good care of yourselves, enjoy the rest of your day, have a great weekend, and I'll see you soon.